Oh man, I'm excited. I'm so excited. If you guys aren't following me on Twitter, maybe you haven't heard about this game just yet. But this is the Backrooms 1998. And I know, Backrooms is kind of an old subject at this point. But listen, this is made by the developer Steel Krill, which is the same developer who made Trenches. Now, if you remember Trenches, that game messed me up badly. It was heartbreaking, it was horrifying, and here we are again with another entry into this developer's catalog. And yes, don't worry, this game is not just a walking simulator as most Backrooms games are. This one is actually a full-fledged stealth survival horror game, more like an escape room, which actually makes some kind of sense. Anyway, the game just came out today on Steam, so I'll put the links down below. Make sure to check it out. Are you guys ready? I'm ready. Let's do it. Oh, and fantastic news, the monster can hear you through your microphone, so if you got one, good luck. Oh boy, here we go. Nice one, Drake. Whoa! Oh, shit! Oh, shit. <sighs> oh, no. Uh, oh, there it is. Oh, the mic! What's this? Uh, oh! Why are you guys congregating right here? I lost a wheel on both sides? Really? I love footprints. <gasps> I have, I have feet. What the hell? <laughs> I have two right feet. Oh my God. No, no, no. Why is it that every time I get to the back rooms, it's always like a starting room, you know? If I whisper. Oh, yep, it picks it up. Oh, fantastic. Okay. Even if I want to whisper to myself, it's not going to work out greatly. Oh, Jesus. Hello? Find a way out and escape. Yeah, that's the main... That would be my professional opinion. Press 1, use the flashlight. Flashlight requires batteries to operate. All right, I'm not going to waste it then. Okay, the ambience already? Uh-uh. Oh, hello. What are you? Uh, I made new friends. His name, I think, was Lee or Larson. Don't remember, I am playing at his house, but it's cold down here in the basement. I wonder when he let me... Oh, no! Aw! A kid? Oh my god, just the thought of a kid clipping in here. He'd be like, this isn't funny! Haha, you locked me in the basement! Okay. Darkness. Don't want to go that way. Can I remove the boards here, or is this locked? Guys? You think this is funny? <laughs> I can grab, throw. I don't want to, but I'm going to. <laughs> yeah, what is that? Well, it's just the run. Running for long periods of time makes you run out of stamina. Running also makes you more. Okay. Yep. Got it. Anyone around? Oh. Oh. <laughs> Is that? There's no way. <gasps> crowbar. You have found a small black crowbar for removing wooden boards. You have found a battery for a flashlight. I have an inventory. Ah, oh, gotta love it, dude. Find a way out and escape. We'll do, buddy. Oh man. <gasps> I just whistled. Oh, I am not a big fan of you. No thanks, dude. Oh, the crowbars for the... Yeah, okay. Got it. Interesting. Okay, this is pretty straightforward uh, back rooms so far, you know? Doors jammed. Yeah, don't worry. I'm getting there. Hello? This is the most populated back rooms! Oh, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. Your, uh, your dirty footprints leave a trail. This can be used as an advantage to see where you came from. <gasps> oh, that's smart. Right, 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 right. Yeah, this is obvious. You know, it's kind of like the... Uh, mm-hmm. 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 What is that? Arrow? 
Dude, zooming in doesn't really do much. And my flashlight sucks. <gasps> <Ooh. Hello? laughs> no, no, no. Your little peeking thing from trenches is not funny. I didn't like it then. I don't like it. Th what am I hearing? What am I hearing? All right. Yep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wrong button, but that's fine. I don't mind. Is that fog? It's fog. These guys want to play peekaboo. Can I hide the locker? I hate, I hate it. Okay, PT. Okay, PT. What does that say? Little Timmy when he was younger with his favorite jacket after eating his favorite lunch, fried chicken. So happy. Okay. Wait, can I? <gasps> can I interact with the items like this? <gasps> That's in a very strange place, but that is pretty cool. Long hallway, it's dark. I know what's coming. I know what's coming. He takes forever to turn on his flashlight. Oh! Oh ho ho! I should Guys, this isn't funny. I should stop being so loud. I should stop being so loud. So I turned off a setting here, which was the VHS blur effects, uh, mainly because I feel like it's so hard to see, but this is the full game experience. I, I turned it off because it's more clarity for you guys, but I'm wondering if I should have it on. What do you guys think? There's something standing right there. There's something standing right there. It's a person. It's a person. Is it a mannequin? Please let it be a mannequin. Do I have to go? Mm. <laughs> oh! Hello? <laughs> hey, hey! Don't turn around and look at me. This is like definitely some psychological. Like this kind, this back rooms is my purgatory, 100%. There's like no question, no question. Nope, no, nope. Okay, I'm supposed to be checking every corner, right? What even is I? Oh. What happened to your head, mate? Oh man, you know what that reminds me of? That Silent Hill 4 monster. The little the little thing with the baby faces. Oh, what now? Oh, the key. Also, what's up with the time going for it so fast? Like I thought that was minutes, wasn't it just that? It's gone. It's gone. Okay. It's trenches all over again. Why does it have to be? Mm, their heads are gone. Heads are gone. I need to light up the heads. Just like the heads. Just like the heads. I need the light. Flashlight, please. I don't know what I'm hearing. I gotta go back. Gotta go back. Gotta go back. Gotta go back. Oh, you still have your head. Why? Why? It's gone. Oh. Yeah, there's a headless kid. What is that? Is that a rat? Oh no, it's your bike. Yeah, I mean, this is 100% just my purgatory. Hello? Uh-huh, uh-huh. This little peeking thing. Severed head was found near his body, 
one of his arms when found some distance away. An autopsy revealed that he had been knocked unconscious with a blunt object, such as a hammer. It is also believed that little Timmy may have been alive while his arms were severed, which could explain why his arms were found further from his body. Little Timmy most likely ran around, armless, for a few minutes, calling out for his parents to rescue him. What the fuck? Later, until he passed out from the loss of blood. Okay. That was the point at which the killers caught up to him and chopped off his head. Oh my the god, okay. That his last meal had been spicy fried chicken. The case is still unsolved. So if anyone has any information, please reach out to the local authorities. It's so this is jackets right here, by the way. Fantastic. Oh my god, I'm hearing breathing or something. What is that? Is that you? Hi, Timmy? Timmy? Please don't do anything rash. Okay. Yeah, I saw that. I saw like a little. Oh, maybe it was the glitch. Never mind. Oh, it was that? God damn it. <laughs> this is not the back rooms I'm familiar with. It really isn't. I'm not used to this. Okay. We're fine. I don't. I saw something. Did you see that? It like flew by. I unlocked it. Oh, my. So, considering that I haven't even used the mechanic of marking the walls, I haven't really been utilizing my footprints because it's very linear right now. I would assume that this is just an intro sequence to introduce me to what hello? I'm- Hi. Is that me saying hello to that thing or is that- Oh my god. Oh my god. What is this? Here we go. So yeah, I'm assuming that this is going to be a nice little intro before we get to the real section of the back rooms. What did it say I could do? Doors open. Hiding spaces, that's always good. Some furniture can be used to hide yourself, such as lockers and under tables. Oh my God. This legitimately is still just an intro. I am gonna die, dude. Okay. I see. Don't run. Don't breathe. Close doors or it will notice. Mark your path. Watch your footprints, blood. What? Hey! <laughs> oh, that's a nice little Easter egg. Hide. Uh, arrows can guide you sometimes. Very good. Thank you for the visual tutorial. This is... I hate it. I hate this so much, dude. Door is locked from the other side. It cannot be opened. Classic. Classic. to accompany my fear. This is great. Yep, 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 yep. Okay, okay. This is fucked up. 
Yeah, I was just about to say that. Everything feels the same. This can't be real. Well, I would just assume at this point that I'm dreaming. I mean, let's be honest. Maybe I don't understand the deep lore of the back rooms, right? But this, this particular version feels a lot more like a Silent Hill 2 version of uh, the back rooms. And I don't mean like visually, I just simply mean that like this, this back rooms is very personal to our character. You know what I mean? Like perhaps I know who Timmy is. <laughs> Fucked up. I need to get out of here right now. Yes, thank you, good sir. What is that?
just like trenches, man. I can't do it. It's too much. Trying to hold it in. I'm wondering, like, could the story be connected, you know? Could it be that, like, this is the hell that I went through in the trenches? It's like an added on some. system. I don't know what's happening to my time right now. you buddy I can't help you
Okay, that changed. I was wondering if maybe he was seeing my doors still being open. Dude, I haven't even utilized... <laughs> I haven't even utilized my paint. I need to do that. I really need to do that. do this without actually marking anything. Does that make me the best player in the world?
Drake. Look at these fools trying to skate. <laughs> Literally calling out for Liam Let's go fuck before. With him. <laughs> Grab the hammer. Liam, get his back. Let's go lock him up. Get the hammer. Get the hammer. Let's go. <laughs> Let's lock him up in Liam's house. Have some fun with this little shit. Mm -hmm. Oh. Almost a week had passed since the shocking, gruesome discovery of little Timmy. The 11-year-old was walking on his way home when he most likely was kidnapped. His mother made a public plea to the killer to release her son, saying she just wanted him home this is so what, she could cook him this his is what the radio meal, was saying earlier. spicy fried chicken. Little Timmy's body was found two days later near the Lakeland Forest. He was found wearing his favorite yellow jacket and blue jean shorts, the same clothes he had been wearing at the time of the kidnapping. However, both of his arms and his head had been detached from his body. It is said that little Timmy was most likely kidnapped and tortured. His severed head was found near his body, while his arms were found some distance away. An autopsy revealed that he had been knocked unconscious with a blunt object such as a hammer. It is also believed that little Timmy may have been alive while his arms were severed, which could explain why his arms were found further from his body. Little Timmy most likely <laughs> It's just so weird hearing this being said. Minutes, calling out for his parents to rescue him to no avail until he passed out from the loss of blood. That is the point at which the killers caught up to him and chopped off his head. The autopsy also revealed that his last meal had been spicy fried chicken. Liam Williams, 18, and Drake Salvatore, 19, were both charged for the kidnapping, torture, and brutal murder of little Timmy after police found a VHS recording belonging to Paul Hart, also 19, after he was admitted to hospital from a skateboarding incident where he died from his injuries just minutes later. The VHS footage shows all of them involved with the kidnapping, captivity, torture, and the brutal murder of little Timmy. They stated that they were not that bad to him? and also fed him his favorite food before the murder took place. Both Liam and Drake received the death sentence for the crime. Paul Hart died of the skateboarding accident. What? Aww. Yeah, he looks like, um, Oliver Tree. Like, young Oliver Tree. Location where Paul Hart, one of the killers, had the accident. Some of his blood can still be visible. <gasps> what? Okay. So, very clearly, the back rooms plays a very minor role. Like, the lore of the back rooms plays a very minor role in this. I wonder, does every item you pick up do something different at the end? Like, if it's the last item you get? Because th that clock room completely changed, and I don't know if that was on purpose. Like, was I supposed to get that one last? But this was a very good game. I enjoyed it. Uh, obviously, Steel Krill, Trenches, this game, very emotional, emotionally driven. Like, again, Backrooms is kind of just the canvas to paint this story rather than uh, it being about the Backrooms. That's why I know there's going to be a lot of people who are, are, are calling for inconsistencies in the lore that there shouldn't it shouldn't be this populated and whatnot and there shouldn't be a monster in the first level whatever this is obviously a more specific story but i enjoyed that 
definitely check it out. Links are down below. Thanks for watching, guys. I hate doing outros because I know all of you guys click off. But regardless, I hope you enjoyed. I know I did. Take care, guys.